I have a Samsung Galaxy A71 here. I'm going to show you how to transfer photos and videos from the phone directly to a Windows computer. Okay, very, very simple. So first thing, obviously, you need the uh, data sync slash charging cable. Doesn't matter, you put a USB-C, doesn't matter. This is another one, but you can use the one that came in the box. Of course, the other end is a USB-A here. So go ahead and find a USB port. Doesn't matter if it's a Windows computer, laptop, PC, whatnot. Just find any USB port. Go ahead and plug it in there. And as soon as you plug it in there, you should have something that shows up here. It says allow access to phone data. Go ahead and click on allow. And now what you want to do, let me just close this window out. Now the next thing you want to do is you just want to go ahead and slide down like this. And then where it says right here, Android USB, USB file transfer, just tap on that right here. Ooh, tap it and then tap it again right down here. Now, you want to leave it on transferring files, okay? If you leave it down here transferring images, you're only able to transfer photos, okay? Anyways, leave it on transferring files and then we can go ahead and transfer the whole shebang, okay? So it's there. Now just go to your computer and open up your... File Explorer here, open that up, and then you want to look for the Galaxy A71, which is right over here. Let me double click on that. And now you can see I have two things here. So my SD card is right here, and I have the other one, uh, my uh, phone, which is my internal memory, all right? So let me just double click on this. And then all your, your uh, photos and your videos, it goes into the DCIM folder. So let's go ahead and double click on that. Now you can see I have two folders in here, okay? I have a folder here for screenshots, all the screenshots that I took. And the one that says camera here, if I double click on that, you can see I have some JPEGs, which is photos, and I have some videos as well. You can tell by the uh, timestamp on there, okay? Anyways, now if you wanna transfer it, what you can do is, I mean, you can just drag and you can drop it onto your desktop, uh, one image or video if you want that, or what I typically do is just go to your desktop, right click and then go down to where it says new and then go to folder and then name this folder whatever you want to um, name it and now go ahead and you can go ahead and drag and drop each one individually or select whichever one you want select whatever you want and you can always drag and drop it or you can just do the whole shebang if you want all of them just highlight it all and this is drag and drop it right into that folder right there, and then give it a second to transfer. And now you can see the folder on my desktop. If I double click, I have those same um, photos and videos that's actually on my phone as well. So pretty simple. Any questions or issues, uh, just comment below, all right? Good luck.